down here. Salt is a way of life. Check it, check it, check it. <laughs> Obviously, the environment down here is all salt. The, the ceiling's salt, the floor is salt, the walls are salt, and to an extent, the air is salt. And you breathe that in, and you can constantly taste the salt. Pretty bad. He has like big minion bone mare, I'm in trouble. And you know me. Always so fucking lucky. <laughs> oh, that's like the biggest fucking minion ever imaginable. He, he's dead. Oh, he has a, like a fourth weapon. Okay. <laughs> I just, I just beat Crip. Yeah, I got wrecked. I didn't know that. Oh yes, here we go. Fuck you. Good old RNG into RNG. Probably has a flame strike or some crap, right? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> flame strike. What am I doing playing this game mode? It's it's so unfair. I'm getting all this sweet early game right now. Basically, he played two pure RNG cards, which led him to have five random spells. Two of which were board clears, and two comboed as two mana remove a 10-10. That let him stall out the game and tempo me enough because my top decks were bad to play Frostlich Jaina. Shoot me in the fucking face! Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Should have played around that. I mean, the mage I just played. Yeah, that was autopilot as fuck. Create random spells, those random spells clear your opponent board three times, and that gives you enough time to draw Frostless Jane, which automatically wins by itself. A lot of skill goes into that, but uh, in, in general, Mage is pretty interesting, I feel. Wow, that fucking top deck. Top fucking deck, dude. So greedy, dude. What are you doing? You can't be serious. What the fuck is this? Do you have swipe as well? What the fuck? No, that's ultimate infestation. I've lost. Fuck you guys. I cannot keep up with these decks. These decks are really good. <laughs> I just I just beat Crip. How come I can never do anything? This this just feels like every time I try to play arena. I need I need I need salt. Salt. Salt me up. Just like, can't do shit. It's not about winning, it's about games playing themselves. It's so frustrating. I'm actually a drooling noob myself. Drooling noobs will still win. Yeah, seems unlikely though, doesn't it? Have to suicide that, play that, heal myself. And hope he has absolutely no damage. Can you guys pray for me, please? I'm gonna need some luck. This is basically half of my arena runs. It's honestly absolutely depressing. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, but there's there's no reason to play this. I know some of you guys watch me to get better at arena. Arena is not worth getting better at. Not right now. 
I think the core problem is there's too there's far too many win more cards that the uh, ladder of difficulty doesn't exist. So like at zero and two you can play a twelve win deck. At six and zero you can play like a terrible deck. It's just all over the place. So most of my runs I just play shit like that. Decks that have no business being where they are constantly. Playing arena just feels like running through a minefield. You just have to dodge the really good decks and get lucky against those that you get into. Yeah. No, I'm not mad at them. It's just really fucking sad. Yeah, that's a pretty solid top deck. What the fuck? This guy's just playing off the top right now. Top fucking deck. Getting it all. He just top deck that dude. dude. This guy's played the draw of the turn since turn two. He just top decked the perfect answer every single one of those turns. And it's been like. Synergy card after synergy card after perfect answer. It hasn't been like anything weak at all. Turns out if you get lucky while you get lucky after getting lucky and then getting lucky for the fourth time in a row, you win at Hearthstone. Wow. That was the other card. So he had Kings and Vi Vine Cleaver most of the game, which are like garbage useless cards in his current state. And he drew an on-curve perfect minion with synergy. From two to eight. So six consecutive turns. And my opponent has perfect answer after perfect answer after perfect answer after really good RNG after perfect answer after perfect answer. Same rogue. Oh really? A sniper wants more action. What a fucking asshole. Do you honestly think Blizzard gives a fuck about the community complaining about the latter experience? All they care about is money. If they gave a shit, they would have removed Death Knight cards from Arena Day 1. Well... I don't think they would have removed Death Knight cards in Arena Day 1. If he has Bone Mare, I'm gonna be in trouble. I'm getting so fucked by RNG today. This is usually where the opponent draws Bone Mare on curve. Oh look, he drew Bone Mare on curve. Uh, that's pretty good. Oh, come on, what is this bullshit? Well Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. Feels bad, man. Top deck multi shot with a coin. Top fucking deck, dude. I can't really do that. Wait! Yeah. How did that happen? I know I'm like headachy as fuck and whatever, but like, how did I miss that? The screen shake from the meteor shifted the card. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? That is so infuriating. How does that happen? It's so fucking dumb. Oh my god, that that is enraging, dude. All right, all right. Let me show you. Let me show you why my arena run ended just now. I can't full screen it because I only have like this piece of the screen on. Anyway, just just fucking watch. All right. All right. So I'm like, yeah, ping, do a meteor, do a coin, and then look, look where my mouse is. My mouse right now. Look, just just look, look at the fucking mouse. 
All right, I know it says Volcanic Potion, but my mouse is on top of the Elemental. You see that? My mouse says Volcanic Potion because the screen shook the Volcanic Potion in front of the card that I actually was hovering when I clicked. Let's watch that again. Oh, can we watch it in like half speed? Okay, hold on. Quarter speed. Oh, this is this is good. Okay. So we do that, and then look, look, like my mouse wasn't. I'm not like fucking trembling. The screen is shaking the volcanic potion on top of my mouse cursor. Look at that. Look at that. Dead fucking center on that card. The screen shook the fucking volcanic potion on my mouse cursor. That's bullshit. <laughs> That's so bullshit. I didn't misclick, dude. My, my mouse is over the fucking card. See if I can like freeze frame it there. All right, all right. Here we go. There we go. There we go. Coin. Yep. You got it, dude. You got it. Okay. Mouse is over the card. <laughs> what? Can I stop getting fucked on RNG? Mm. The pain! Appendix. Why is there so much of it? This is really like super shit luck. Oh. oh! Fuck you. See? We just got a little bit lucky. A little bit fucking lucky. Slam duck. Oh fuck. Yeah, I'm just constantly getting out tempoed. Where did he have another eviscerate? Didn't he already eviscerate me once? Yeah, I guess. I guess he has another eviscerate. Alright, guys, let me just think another couple subs real quick. We got Crips Juicy Bullshit. Alright, let me bring up the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 okay. times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. So you got circle or something? Really? Bro, <laughs> one. <laughs> that denied a draw, denied a free kill, and denied charge on this thing. Well, he can't take my Dragonfire Potion, but he can take my Shadow Reaper Anduin, so that would be just peachy. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. You just can't get into it because they would never understand. What the fuck is going on? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Come on! Salt. Salt me up. What the fuck? Can I please get Shadow Reaper now? Come on, Shadow Reaper, one fucking time! What the hell is that? The? Come on, Shadow Reaper! Come on! Fucking painful. This is one of the most frustrating games I've ever played. Two cards left. 
Shadow Reaper. And the Shifting Shade that he took two of. It's kind of taking a while here. Oh, that's bad. The problem is that's a dragon. Otherwise, who cares? Hmm. Well, that's that. Uh -huh. I just, I just beat crit. I deserved a Liz. You guys always think that. <sighs> How am I gonna win now? No fucking idea. I don't have any clue how I'm gonna win. He just top pick me. Man. Yeah, some of these answers just straight up destroyed me. Not very much to do. Can you guys pay me for my virtual kitten? My virtual kitten need, needs virtual cat food, or the virtual kitten will starve to virtual death. Just imagine a world, guys. <laughs> Alright. I'm trolling a little bit, but it, it does sound kind of dumb. And make a lot of dollars with a virtual salt shaker. Dude, I think you're right. I can be the pet. I can be the real pet and you can feed me virtual salt. I need, I need, I need salt. Salt. Salt me up. Jesus Christ, this guy's lucky. Are you fucking kidding me? Top fucking deck, dude. Uh, it was... Either I'm getting sniped or that was just tragic fucking luck. Yeah, he got a disgusting amount of perfect answers consecutively. I misplayed a little bit, but it wouldn't have made a difference. Bullshit decks, bullshit RNG. Oh my god. Getting destroyed by fucking zoo priest. Let me change your life. More answers, come on. Oh, I fucking hate priest. <laughs> Sucks. Top deck bone mare. Top fucking deck, dude. Win more, win more, win more, win more, and a bunch of answers in between. You yeah. know. This run has been very sad. I'm, I'm literally losing to drooling noob right now. Two consecutive games where my opponent had an answer to every single play I made the entire game. Make it three and I'm going to bed. Always quality arena. Well, I'd do my best, but I can't really say that about my arenas. This shit's been a clown show the last half hour. How do you talk to a girl? You open your mouth and... ...drop some words and stuff. How do you talk to a vegan? <laughs> you show up with a lot of lettuce, okay? If you've brought enough, they'll talk to you back. If they're still not talking to you, just bring more next time. Alright, dude. Fuck this shit. You just top picked another one. Fuck you. Twelve cards, two volcanoes. What is this? This is called Crip Arena, guys. Golden fucking Raza, shit. Oh, he's got the light card back. That's super rare. Oh, I'm fucking dead. Mm. Alright, I'm going to bed. Nice. 
That was 12 cards, 100% perfect answers, 2 legendaries, bone mirror on curve. Yeah, I don't know how I'm always playing against perfect answers against priests. Priest is literally the least likely class in arena to have perfect answers against your plays. The clunkiest removal in the game. My last two losses were priests that had 100% answers to all of my plays. Fucking really, dude. That's such a ridiculous way to lose. The? I just, I just beat Crip. Two losses out of the last three matches, which have all been druids, both to really good answers constantly. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Yeah, we're getting trolled right now. So it's gotta be a sniper with the god hand with an insane deck. Nice. It's not playing around Bone Mary. Yeah, lead the last turn. It's obvious. There's no way this decision can be that hard. The? That hope. So cruel. Yeah, he's just trolling me with the missed lethals and shit. Just a sniper. Crazy deck. Very lucky. How is my draw this bad, dude? Oh my god. Oh, come on. What? What? Holy fuck. I think he has a fireball. Oh. And Hearthstone's like, yo, Crip, fuck you. Here's a loss. I really think I'm like a science project for like Blizzard devs to screw with. Okay. Well, we have a lethal opportunity here. By the light. That Whoa. happened. <laughs> All right, uh, well. Seriously? All right. Seen a lot of DKs today. I think the average number of legendaries I've played against and seen them play is about 0.7, which is ridiculous because we see about one third to one half of the deck usually. So I have seen a ridiculous number of legendaries on the other side. I haven't seen any in my four drafts though. Like, we've seen a lot of weird shit today. Like, matchmaking seems off. Nobody has any bone mares, right? We've seen one bone mare in four hours of arena. This is the fourth run. One bone mare is what we saw. We, we have seen... All right, if, if the 70% is true... If the 70% is true... How many games have I played? Let me have a quick look. This is 26. This is my 27th game. So 26. So let's say I've let's say I've played against people with 35 legendaries. That means I've played against no, because we can't use that because we have we may have missed bone mares. 26. Okay, 26 times 0.7. So we have seen about. 16 to 18 times more legendary cards than we have a bone mare. For the one bone mare that we've seen, we've seen about 16 to 18 legendary cards. 
There's there's something going on. They messed with something. Normally you can't you can't go 30 minutes without seeing two bone mares in the arena. Arena yesterday was who plays the first bone mare. We've seen one in four hours. Fuck! 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 This is bullshit, dude. What the fuck just happened? Prep, Steed, Dark Conviction. Fuck you guys. I, I give up. You guys told me to play control. Well, I'm gonna play players who can't possibly lose control games. Like, what the fuck is that? What the fuck is this? Crazy synergy, crazy card quality. Like two Spike Ridge Steeds, that's no offering bonus in half the deck with half the class cards given. Like, come on! And my opponent has perfect answer after perfect answer after perfect answer. It's absolutely insane, dude. You know how my draft quality would improve? If I was offered constant Spike Ridge Steeds and Legendaries, I think my. My win percentage might go up in that case. I don't think I need a 1-1 one, one right now. Let's not have a 6-10 taunt get mind control teched. And I mean, I'd have to buy a new keyboard if that happens. So. This is a nice keyboard. I don't want to destroy it. Oh my <laughs> god. Okay. Seems alright. Turns out if you get lucky while you get lucky after getting lucky and then getting lucky for the fourth time in a row, you win at Hearthstone. Wow. This is like death knight number 10 for the night, for the record. I'm, I'm literally losing to drooling noob right now. Constructed? No, dude. This deck is better than Constructed. I don't know what the fuck could possibly beat this in Constructed that's not an aggro deck. No, there's no way I can win. The? I just... I just beat Crip. Wow. Magic. Thank you. You're getting your appendix out because of me. Oh, wow. I'm glad I could inspire that, too. Basically, what I noticed on Reddit earlier today was everyone's doing like the dick measuring contest, thinking they can figure out the game within the first five hours faster and better than the others. It's just a bunch of bullshit. Like, nobody knows what the best combination is. Um, it seems to be like the pieces come from the better classes in Arena from before. So, you know, there's some truth to a lot of that, but that's all there is, just some truth. Put your faith in the light. Top decks. Top fucking deck, dude. Come on, man. Good to know he drew every single piece of early game in his deck so far. I can't keep up. I got out-tempoed by a ridiculous late game deck that's Priest and Mage. For sure we're dead here. Oh, he just drew that. Okay. Fuck you. Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. Yeah, pretty busted. <laughs> These decks are so fucking crazy, dude. It's actually just blowing my mind right now. What the fuck? Really? Next one, huh? Uh, the only chance I have is his hand is all early game, and both deaths are at the bottom. Oh, no, that's a fourth death that was not drawn since I played that. So he has four Shadow Word deaths. At least.
It's another gigantic minion? What the fuck? These decks are just too good. Dude, this guy this guy must have played with too many fidget spinners to make that play. Can't can't outplay decks that are this good. And fucking half of them are this good. Rip arena run. Well played. I just missed the arena where people struggled with shitty cards and trying to put anything together. After, like, a few wins, Arena, and before this, just doesn't feel like Arena at all. Alright. Can you please not kill this minion with a spell for, like, the sixth consecutive time? Please? That was two pleases. What is the fuck? I played a secret on turn two, and since then he killed every minion that I played the entire game with a spell. Okay. Why a sniper? He just had it. He just had a really silly fucking deck, and he got the cards he needed when he needed them. But th the difference in deck quality is so crazy. Like, my chance of winning that last game was, like, 2%. Fun games are ones that have the aspects of interesting games. And you have at least a double fucking digit chance to win, alright? I know you guys like it when I lose, but... I like it when I at least have some chance. Let's put it that way. If I have a double digit chance to win, that's fine, you know? But, like, that was fucking impossible. Oh, now we're going for it. When you're a drooling noob and miss lethal. How the fuck can you get so lucky while being such an asshole? Dual class is fun and stuff, but twice the heroes means twice the bullshit. The problem is it's ice block. If it was not ice block, I'd have a chance here. Yeah, it's 100% ice block. Oh my fucking ass, dude. Oh, going for it. It's 100% ice block. There is no going for it. We checked vaporize, we checked ice barrier. It's 100% ice block. I, I give up. That was a 77 point control deck. The problem with 77 points control deck is uh, you still have close to no chance against hero cards. You just hit 6 out of 6 lotto numbers. But instead of being a millionaire, he just beats me and hurts them. I think I played against hero cards in more than half of my games. Now, Drax is a fine hero card, but like. What's not fine is when half of your opponents play Jiraxis against you or some similar variant. Is winning in Hearthstone more intuition or math? Is math related to science? I'm not like super clear on the definition of intuition. Can you have intuition in a video game? I thought intuition was like... Not a real thing. This guy must have played with too many fidget spinners. Uh, I don't know, I'm probably just dumb. Uh, fuck, what was the question again? Was... Oh, come on, dude! Uh, what the fuck is this shit? Dude! That shit is cheating! Report him! What's going on here is I'm playing a 12-0 deck at 5-2. and two. What's going on here is I'm having loads of fun right now. The? <laughs> I just, I just beat Crip. Literally no chance in hell. Hmm. Yeah. That's the really depressive side of Arena right now. In 15 Arena runs, in the dual class Arena, I got a hero card once. It was a pretty mediocre deck. 
I got 12-0. Get, get over yourself and have some fun. How, how are you, okay, how are you supposed to have fun when you play against ridiculous Death Knight cards? Where is the fun in that? <laughs> playing against Death Knight cards in, in arenas like playing against fucking Yugi or whatever. That cheating asshole. Can't lose. You might think you got him, but like, nah, he finds a way. You're just like fucked. I beat like, I beat like two frostless Janas in the last week. What the hell kind of fun is that? Give me a break. I, will serve. I can have fun in the games that don't involve hero cards. I can try that, yeah. I don't have a board clear. This is just over. Fuck you guys. I'm sure silver was way too much tempo. He has to whiff really hard to lose. It's my miracle card. No, not much of a miracle. <laughs> Yeah, I just got fucked up by True Silver into Crazy Beast Synergy. Mm -hmm. And you know me. Always so fucking lucky. Card quality doesn't matter. It's all about having answers. It's like a third game in a row where, like, I get answered and then my opponent plays something I can't deal with. It's game over right away. Me. Oh, give me a fucking break, dude. How am I gonna win now? No fucking idea. It's just like, the moment you don't have an answer, game over. Yeah, I thought I only listed Death Knight cards, but, um... No, I just didn't realize I have, like, no decent answers except for the weapon, which I've drawn in the early game only once against a bunch of Divine Shield one-drops. Hmm. Constructed? No, dude. This deck is better than Constructed. Two and two. Such fucking bullshit, dude. If I get a little bit more of this, I'm done. I don't want to play this. Come on! Fuck! The third one? This dumbass has like nuclear weapons. He just doesn't know where to fire them. I am stupid. So many bloody decisions. This guy's deck is disgusting. Fuck you. How do you lose with this deck? He has removal, he has crazy card quality, he has board clears, he has a death knight with crazy synergy. His card quality is just ridiculous. I got a taunt, I maybe go face. Nope. He has a vaporize. Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Well, better luck next time. And this is why you can't fucking play control decks. Because even the shittiest players in the whole game will annihilate you. Can you guys believe this is Arena? I can't. Because hero cards are fucking awesome. Let's play against twice as many. Why stop there? Rank and standard? I don't know. Rank 4? I was gonna go for Legend, but this Arena thing came out. And my appendix said, fuck you. So, I'm not sure if that's going to work out this month. But that was the goal. Ten top decks in a row. What? It's only been six turns, dude. Oh, shit. That's really bad. Does he have deadly shots? Okay, game over. Alright, you guys say ten top decks in a row for me, but his cards are zero and one right now. Top fucking deck, dude.
any top deck deadly shot. <laughs> like, I'm not the only one drawn ridiculously fucking well right now. The double taunt play could have actually worked and recovered me the game. So a guy who has a really fucking crazy priest deck with a priest death knight queued up against me at 3 and 0 lost and queued up against me once again at 4 and 1. Purely coincidental, I'm sure. Bullshit decks, bullshit RNG. Fuck you. Either I'm getting sniped or that was just tragic fucking luck. So rude. If you are gonna go out of your way to snipe me with the best deck you've ever had, happen to lose after crazy advantages, like, and actually snipe me again in the same fucking run 10 minutes later, holy shit you're an asshole. I'm literally just never gonna play Arena without delay again. This is my last arena run tonight. It's bullshit. Oh! There you go. Apparently you can get it in arena. If his priority is killing a 0-8 right now, he's just gonna lose, isn't he? I'm pretty sure he's just gonna lose. Hoping so, at least. Merlin Pogchamp. Yes, of course. <laughs> he loses a taunt. Oh god. Oh, this can't be smart. Oh, well, okay. It's a really good one to get right now because he just sacrificed massive tempo. Wow, and he didn't discard the cost zero ones, and he played that last. Holy shit, dude! The RNG is so fucking real. I'm so salty right now. <laughs> what the fuck? This is what happens when you deny my Marin challenge. I'm watching you poop right now. I'm watching you. Yes. Yes. I know you're you're looking side to side to see where the camera is. That's right in front. I can see you. Looks like it's another depressing night of arena. Damn. This dude's arithmetic skills are way above average. Bullshit decks, bullshit RNG. Is it true that being vegan turns you into a treant? Yes, it's true. Being vegan is wrong. It's against nature. Imagine tiger vegan or lion vegan. Bullshit, isn't it? Absolute bullshit. Well, gorillas are vegan. Bullshit, isn't it? <laughs> Give me a break. You're sitting in a chair, watching someone else play a video game on an electronic system halfway around the world. Dude, this guy, this guy must have played with too many fidget spinners. We're going with nature fallacies here? Come on, bro. Let's get real. What percentage of my viewers do I think are on the toilet watching me? Not zero percent. Oh, you cannot be fucking serious right now. What is this? This is called Crip Arena, guys. I just don't know how to win. When you don't know how to win, you just go face. You just can't win. Like, drawing one card at a time is not possible. The? I just, I just beat Crip. That sucks. Sniper? Probably. It's very hard for him to lose this game, though. Can I stop getting fucked on RNG? I'm just losing to much better decks. That's about it. Rip me. Sad arena. Just lose to better decks, and I don't draw well enough. That's about it. Nothing to it. Okay, yeah, he had flame strength, so that's pretty bad. Streamers just get guaranteed legendaries every arena. Yeah, right. Oh, 
This is some bullshit here. He needs another board clear here. Bold play, thank you. Alright, let me bring up the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. Fuck you. Bunch of bullshit cards plus top deck lethal there. Yeah, in four turns he played two fireballs, frostbolt, and that flame geyser crap. And my opponent has perfect answer after perfect answer after perfect That's a answer after crazy really good RNG after perfect answer after perfect answer. That is bullshit, dude. Like he drew like thirteen cards that game. Right? Really good card quality. Fireball, fireball, frostbolt, flame geyser, flame strike. Yeah. So salty right now. Salt me up. What the fuck? Give me a fucking break. I'm, I'm just playing constructed. My opponents are extremely lucky. They have much better decks than they should ever have. And you just can't win under those circumstances. There's not there's not enough skill in Hearthstone for me to win. It's not. I can't outplay them. It's not possible in this first one. Yeah, do you know what's better than uh, having Lich King is playing it first and playing your opponent's Lich King first. That's that's a lot better. Like a lot better. Over. Yeah, crazy unlucky against an insane deck once again. I just want five wins, but that's not happening. Looks like it's another depressing night of arena. A couple more of these, and I think I'm done with arena until they either release the next expansion or do another event. I keep trying, but I keep having a bad experience. So what's the point? I just low rolled it. Basically, my strategy was, if I can land a 3 on that, I can kill that. If I can land a 3 on that, I can kill that at least and tempo out a little bit. But I landed 2 on both of them, which puts me in a situation where I'm basically completely fucked. What would Uther do? What would Uther do, guys? Please help. I'm still very much dead, I believe. Yes, 1 over lethal. The? I just, I just beat crit. Three zero. See, we just got a little bit lucky. A little bit fucking lucky. Easy to the peasy. Piece of crap. Top deck multi shot. Top fucking deck, dude. Okay. Really? Saving that the whole game. Yeah, this is some sniper bullshit. There's no fucking way you saved that the whole game. That was like a card he's had since turn three. There's no way. He played the fucking bear shark over giant wasp. There's no way. This is BS territory right now. Have to land it. This is bullshit. Welcome to Bullshit Arena. Yeah, maybe he wasn't sniping. I think he was just really bad. Turns out if you get lucky while you get lucky after getting lucky and then getting lucky for the fourth time in a row, you win at Hearthstone. Wow. We must cleanse the sun well. Nope. Savage top deck to the rescue, it seems. Wow, what do you say after that one? Brutal, savage. Top fucking deck, dude. There's mostly just some dumb luck there. Oh, yeah. 
Speaking of dumb luck, I love it. Yeah, it looks like it's over. This guy had a really good deck, and he got a few very, very crucial top decks exactly when he needed them. Yeah. I lost the three bad players. That feels bad. I was feeling the warrior hype, but it's gone. Oh look, balanced arena card is balanced. It's over. The? I just I just beat Crip. Never lose to good players, just good decks. Eh, good decks plus good luck. That that two that combo it's just unstoppable in Hurts then. If you have a good deck and you have good luck, it almost doesn't matter what you do. Most of my mage runs end in ultimate disappointment because I think I have a really good control deck and then I play control decks that are considerably better and I have no chance. This is a... This is a really shit deck. This is a deck that loses to just about everything. My salty person. Mostly when I play this. He has the last two turns of draws, a random death rattle minion, and a random minion over five. Fucking wonderful. Incoming crazy punish yet again, am I right? Punish stone, here we go. This is the draw, by the way. He didn't have this last turn. Let's see what miraculous crushing card he managed to draw this time. Oh, complete board refresh. Oh, that's a pretty good draw, bro. With six mana. Hmm. Oh, that's pretty good. You think I'm lucky enough to get a... Primordial Drake. Nope. Tertolan Forager Bone Mare. I even lost that 50 50. It's just so frustrating. Like, every single thing you do, your opponent just, like, gets an answer. Oh, look. What is that exact lethal? No, he's one man off. You'd never pick Innervate. But he'd also never buff an already buffed minion. So I guess he picked Innervate. Claw. Yeah. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Every night. I can feel my leg, and my arm, even my fingers. The body I've lost. Oh come on, what the hell is this bullshit? So you're telling me this guy had like 20 direct damage in hand? What is this? This is called Crip Arena, guys. All right. Can you guys pray for me, please? I'm gonna need some luck. How does everyone I play have so many answers? I'm playing fucking Rogue, I don't have anything close to that. <laughs> Man, that's bullshit. Bullshit Dex, bullshit RNG. Yeah, that guy had 20 direct damage as a druid. That's unreal. Welcome to Bullshit Arena. Like, that's as much as you'd... Like, that's as much as you'd hope to get in a whole deck. Not the first, like, 12 cards. Yeah. Let's see if we can play a game without getting completely fucked by a million consecutive answers that we can't possibly play around. Yeah. Yeah, I'm alive. Okay. Well, I'm not sure if alive counts. I'm, like, crippled and unconscious in a bed right now, but... Technically.
technically alive, legally alive. No, fuck, fuck you. Oh. Fuck that shit, dude. Come on. No. No, <laughs> I just, I just beat Crip. Really? He top decked the one that he dumped in his deck? You gotta be joking. Yeah, this might work. Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> okay. This might work now. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. You just can't. Oh, come on! What the fuck? You cannot be serious here. The? <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Three and two my fucking ass, dude. There you go. He has absolutely nothing. He also has death. And dream. I really think I'm like a science project for like Blizzard devs to screw with. I'm like the guinea pig where they test how much RNG is tolerable until you just like break your keyboard, right? If that's really what you think, you need to watch a lot more of my stream with an open mind. <laughs> I mean, even if I had cards in my deck, how the fuck would I win against the priest with like 9 cards full health and Yasera on the board? I think for how stupid that game was, I'm hardly salty here. I need salt. Um... I vividly remember her kicking a young disabled kid in a wheelchair across the road into a cactus when he asked, um, where did you get your BlizzCon badge? It's burned into my memory, so. This is insane curve warrior going first. I mean I can't I can't do anything. I don't have spells. Doesn't have weapons. Oh. Fire Plume Phoenix. Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. Never luck. I mean that was a bad deck. Jesus, we're getting high rolled like there's no tomorrow on this one. Well, it's not only that our deck sucked, we played against people who were unbelievably lucky. There's no denying it. Wow. Wow, dude. This is bullshit. Oh my god, that's so painful. <laughs> I'm pretty bad at every game. That's out of context. I am stupid. Fucking crazy. Mm. Bim. Four mana, seven, seven. There's so many here. Holy shit, dude. Whoa! Oh, that's pretty rough, man. That's pretty rough. Dude, why am I even here? Oh! Hold on. Fuck, where is it? Four mana. Seven, seven. Oh, it's really fucking frustrating. Still alive, guys. Still alive. Well, I'm not quite PewDiePie level. No. Would you vote Crypt for president? Pretty sure I'd do a pretty decent job. Right? Can't be, can't be much worse than what you got. Seems easy. I mean, how much worse can you do compared to fucking everything up? 
I could also just fuck everything up. I'd be as good, right? Right? Pretty good, right? Rogue's really good. I like Rogue. I don't get salty playing Rogue very much. It's it's pretty tough to lose playing Rogue right now. I, I actually think Rogue is, is broken. Broken tier in Arena right now. I think it was the best class by like a few percentage points, and now I think it's the best class by like fucking 10%. I think it's not even close. I think Rogue is number one by a landslide. There's no chance. It's it's pretty tough to lose playing Rogue right now. And it was I who was out tempo that time. Rip. I don't know. He might be really bad at math, right? Turns out if you get lucky Possible. while you get lucky after getting lucky and then getting lucky for the fourth time in a row, you win at Earthstone. Yeah. Looks like it doesn't really need that. Oh, better luck next time. No, that was basically another amazing game of fuck you, you lose. That's about it. You'll never win against an opponent who gets lucky like six different times at critical points in the game. It's not possible and hurts them. I really don't think anyone who's played like five games or five runs of Arena could possibly think that Death Knights belong in Arena. I guess... I guess you could make that statement with like maybe seven of the Death Knight cards, but the Mage Death Knight and the Priest Death Knight are just really stupid. I don't get too hyped when I get lucky. What? Where did I get lucky? Did I get lucky because my opponent is absolutely terrible and he just healed me for six for no reason? And I would have died otherwise. I guess, yeah, I guess that's pretty lucky, but... <laughs> Looks like I'm probably just gonna die anyway. Does he have Panda top deck? He does. <laughs> yeah. I'm so fucking lucky, guys. Oh, look. There's another really lucky card. Yeah. So, what happened? Played well. Lost to a garbage player. Who got luckier than I did and had a better deck. Wow. Literally every loss tonight. Every single loss. Okay. Either I'm getting sniped or that was just tragic fucking luck. Yeah, I got so lucky. Yep. So lucky. Alright, I'm done with this shit. Let's go play Battle Raid. Yeah, sometimes I probably exaggerate the way I lose, or seemingly exaggerate the way I lose. I know a lot of times I'm like, this guy's fucking sniping, this guy's fucking sniping. And honestly, a lot of the time I say that they are. I think almost all the time. But, you know, some of you guys don't know the whole sniper situation. It's understandable. I just, I just beat Crip. Fuck you. Last one I made the Fellfire Potion play. Well, dude, I didn't realize you had a 7 damage lifesteal removal card. It totally fucked me over this turn. I think that's pretty extreme, dude. Like, he had to have this specific rare card, but not just that. He needed to have it in his hand the entire game. I mean, yeah, that happened, but that's very unlikely. How the fuck is this 0-1, dude? Bullshit decks. Don't dragon slay me. It's like the second dragon I've played. Bullshit RNG. Wait, I actually got dragon slayed? So salty right now! Are you fucking kidding me?
Really? That one? I'm getting fucking destroyed right now. Like, this does not- like, what the fuck? How is that 0-1? That guy's deck was crazy! Like, really high card quality, really good synergy, really good curve. Like, I had like seven epics. Okay. Dude, like, I got my fuck. No, no. I got crazy fucking unlucky that game, dude. Fuck you guys. Like, everything I did got punished. My fucking one dragon, like, like this, this first dragon I played in this fucking expansion got dragon slayed. And if that didn't happen, I would have had, like, permanent tempo. I would have gained, like, 10 fucking HP. I think I got sniped, like, I created a really good deck and just surrendered the first game. That's probably more likely than a deck like that actually being at 0-1. Oh my fucking god. Am I a salty person? Mostly when I play this. I have been punished every single turn of every single game in this arena run. Are you fucking kidding me? This is such bullshit. He's going face with weapons because he doesn't give a shit. Like, that's a really good card. He's playing really good card after really good card after really good card. Oh, where's my Dragon Slayer? Where is it? I don't see it. <laughs> oh look, another top tier card. Zero three. I just don't know how to win. I am stupid. Yep, really fucking good deck, tempoed out. Like crazy. The day shitty players actually lose a lot in Hearthstone, it's gonna be a really good fucking day. Well, that's encouraging. That guy's deck was really good. I mean, he played like absolute shit, but it didn't matter. If you have the right cards at the right time, you don't really need more than two brain cells. I mean, I'm sure I made a mistake here and there, but it wasn't the difference. I just got, like, fucked every single turn and got tempoed out like crazy. Every single game. You don't really need more than two brain cells. It's like, we're alive. And now we're dead. Alright, let's actually play a new deck now. Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. <laughs> yeah, I just kind of got tempoed out by small shit. It's whatever. Very, very whatever arena game. Mm. Fuck you. Both paladins I played played two spike ridged on turn six and seven. How the fuck can you get so lucky while being such an asshole? It's like no card drawn. Like, oh, here it is. There's my spike ridge. And get. Okay. All right. Spike ridge. Oh. Man, I wonder how this guy won games to get to 3-0. How, how do you guys think he did it? He must have played really well, right? He must have. Uh -huh. I just... I just beat Crip. Yep. That was draw 12. So, in the first 14 cards, he had three spike ridge steeds. He had no cards left, I would have stabilized if he didn't have the third one. Do you know what's gonna happen, guys? Okay, I've played two Paladins and I'm averaging 2.5 Spike Ridge Steeds against me. What's gonna happen is, I'm gonna play this and he's gonna play fucking Spike Ridge Steed again. So, why should I play that? I don't know. Unless it's Deathwing. Shit, it's death me. Oh, fuck. That's bad. Oh, can't do that spike ridge, right? Yeah, it's spike ridge. It's just sitting in hand for a long time. Don't understand why. Okay. 
and my opponent has a perfect answer after perfect answer after perfect answer after really good RNG after perfect answer after perfect answer. Doesn't really say much for Paladin, like, every single Paladin we played had Weapon, Ward Clear, and Spike Reaches. Basically, if you get all of that, you can win, and I guess if you don't, you don't. I just, I just lose. Top deck answer. Top fucking deck, dude. Uh, I caught back up eventually, but no. Yeah. <clears throat> no. He had higher quality cards. He had Nersh immediately when we both ran out of cards. Just can't beat that. And Hearthstone's like, yo, Crip, fuck you. Here's a loss. Oh, better luck next time. Oh, single target dragon fire potion. Four and one. How the hell is that happening, dude? Single target dragon fire potion when he has like four cards. What the hell? Let me change your mind. More two for ones. I'm just playing against a guy who has like an 80 point control deck. I'm playing a god basically. I'm, I'm a mere mortal myself. So unlucky! Why? Oh, so unlucky! Oh. This is usually the card that produces death knights and depression at the same time. I just need to survive one turn. He is ten cards ahead of me. Can I stop getting fucked on RNG? I was sniped more. I'd like to think so, but I don't know that for sure. That's wonderful. Yeah, every single Warlock game I've lost has been exactly the same. I don't understand how Warlock is very good. Like, I know it's supposedly, like, second or third in arena right now but it loses to the strategy of tempoing out in the early game and direct damage in the late game which doesn't sound very good when it's facing up against hunter and hunter is the number one class right now so how does that work so far arena seems very much rock paper scissors play warlock get shit on by direct damage Play direct damage, get shit on by priest. Play priest, get shit on by tempo. It's like all six losses of the warlock that I've had. Three today, three yesterday. It's exactly the same. Get out tempoed a little bit, then direct damage comes in. Game over. Everything the same. Yeah. Rock, paper, scissor might work for constructed, but that's just because constructed's a shithole with low expectations now. Are you fucking serious? Did you get that off the Cabal Courier? <laughs> Man, I think we're getting sniped. Zero, zero, Kazakus on curve active. Fuck that shit, dude. I'm taking a drink just for fun. <laughs> just to forget. Alright. Was that a death on the shadow? Thanks, you played a death on the Ancient of War. Oh my fucking god. And well, hopefully he runs out of bullshit answers after playing bullshit cards and fucking Kazakas on curve. Are you serious? Played Starfire on the Cobalt Scalebane. Okay. Did he have another death? Yes, he had another Fuck death. Fuck this! Close arena, more. I'm done. <laughs> this is more. actually bullshit. Zero, zero, my the... Down here, Fish salt is a day. way of life. Check it, check it, check it. Obviously, the environment down here is all salt. The, the ceiling's salt, the floor is salt, the walls are salt, and to an extent, the air is salt. And you breathe that in, and you can constantly taste the salt. I don't want to be too far behind on the board, at least. 
No, top deck, probably not. Top fucking deck, dude. That's pretty rough. Let's see if we win this. Fuck you guys. Oh. Fuck. I'm so salty right now. Are you fucking kidding me? Constructed? No, dude. This deck is better than constructed. Shit, I don't know if I can do the value game now. I mean, healing for four every turn is pretty bad. Oh. Oh. What the fuck? That's too much. That guy's deck is really good. Well <laughs> I just, I just beat Crip. She's getting so unlucky so many consecutive games right now. I mean, these are not very powerful answers, just... He's getting them exactly where he needs them, game after game after game. Yeah. Well done. Three zero to four and three. Super unlucky. Yeah, I think I played pretty well, but I got very unlucky with all my ran like all my random pulls. And I played against some pretty strong decks at the end. I mean you know what a good card is for Warrior? Zero mana five five. That's a pretty good card when you're already winning, yep. If he goes twelve zero drink my piss, I'll join you on that one, because uh, it's not happening. I uh, showed up in the wrong neighborhood, guys. This 4-0 neighborhood is too rough for me. This jungle Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, come on. Is he gonna death that as well? Okay, a different death. Oh. Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. Any deck is deserving of four and three is this one. Oh shit. That guy's deck is really good. I'm playing against some insane decks. My deck is like the worst thing ever. Bless you. I mean I really cannot expect to do well here. That's just not a reality. Like these decks are crazy. Last two of phase. So <laughs> Hey Crypt. Long time donator, first time viewer, all my family has died to veganism, so here's five dollars to help fight the vegans. P.S. Kill the animals. Damn, dude. The single huge problem in Hearthstone is rank mode. It's such a complete mess, but it's been that way for so long that I think people just accept it. But the thing is, new players don't accept it. They play it, and they're like, this sucks, and they're right. And then they don't play anymore. Like, everything about rank mode is bad. Like, just everything. It, it resets, uh, it doesn't represent your rank unless you play all the time, but like, very few people play all the time. It's just, the rewards are bad, yeah, the new player experience is bad, net decking is out of control, uh, it favors aggro decks over slow decks. The biggest problem here is rank mode. It's not even close. It's the most obvious thing in the world. It's just, again, people are used to it by this point. I just fucking lost the game on that. I was planning on copying it. Rip me. If he has another answer here, I'd probably lose. Yeah, fireball. Every single answer, dude. This guy's running perfect. He has 100% removal for every single card that I played. And... Big taunts. Save the secret for spellstone? I can't. The issue with that is, in Arena, it's very difficult to get two good one drops. More taunts! That was the luckiest shit you could possibly have there. This is absolute bullshit. We got Crypt's juicy bullshit. Bullshit decks, bullshit RNG. The? I just, I just. Fuck you. Textbook first versus second game. Yep. If 
you go first and have every single perfect answer, you're going to be the hunter. Close to 100% of the time. Do I expect to never lose? Oh, no. I expect to lose from time to time. Car starts down. This guy's curve and tempo is just absolutely ridiculous. I mean, a free 5-5 five, five is uh, the main problem. How am I going to win now? No fucking idea. Yeah. Well, it was a bad start, but I mean, honestly, I don't feel bad for losing that. There's like literally no fucking chance I can win that. It's like absolutely no way. No way, good choice. If he's got like siphon soul or something, oh. Looks like it was not a good choice, guys. Poor choice. Oh, fucking hell, dude. I'm not super happy about that. I'm pretty happy about that. He's gonna take some damage here. Might not even clear the board. Or he's gonna clear most of the board and take no damage whatsoever. <laughs> One over lethal. But if he fucks up, yeah, he fucked it up. That guy went from having lethal into possibly losing. So fucking bad. Okay, you guys didn't hear anything? Nothing happened. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I stopped getting countered. Ha! This guy's toast. Not anytime soon, I guess. May a fool reject the Lich King! Top deck spell damage. Top fucking deck, dude. Top fucking deck, dude. I don't understand how the shitty decks get so fucking unlucky. Damn. Remember how, like, every day this week, I'm like, why is there a fucking gigantic Overwatch ad on my battle net? I'm like, fine, whatever. I guess. I guess Blizzard stock has to go up. They have to make people watch this shit, right? Yeah. There's now an Overwatch button on the Battle.net launcher. I don't know if you guys saw this. This is this happened today. Okay, so I mean man, how could I how could I do a screenshot of this? Hold on. Okay. I'm here, see? So this is the image I'm talking about. Alright, let me see if I can zoom in. Alright. So So hey. Alright. So we have Overwatch the game. Okay. We have Overwatch the game. We're not playing Overwatch the game. I, I don't actually like Overwatch very much. Anyway, so I'm trying to play Hearthstone, and for the last like 10 days there's been this giant thing there that's apparently more important than anything else including my friends to watch the Overwatch League inaugural season. Oh my god, it's gonna be crazy, right? Okay. Now, if you see at the top there, see, there, see at the top, See that? Okay. Now if you see at the top there, there's a fucking Overwatch League button. Okay. So there's games, there's social, there's shop, there's news, and there's Overwatch League. Okay. Like, come on. Come on, Blizzard. All right. Enough is enough. We, we get it. You, do you think, I, you think I didn't see that gigantic ad for the... Overwatch inaugural season on my Battle.net launcher the last two weeks. I didn't see that. Like, I, I need an Overwatch League button. Fuck me, man. That guy's dick was really good. I, I honestly don't think I've seen this much in-game desperation promotion with anything I've ever played before. 
Alright. Complaining for the sake of complaining. Dude. I'm getting a double ad, and I'm not even playing the game. All right. You don't have that button? Good for you, bro. You should feel proud. But how are they going to pay for the arena? Well, it might have to do with the fact they're charging uh, teams $20 million to participate in the Overwatch and Augur League. That's, that's probably how they're going to pay for it, actually. yeah, that, Probably it's already paid for, my guess. Oh, you guys didn't know that? Yeah, it costs... If you want to play in the Overwatch League as a team... You need to pay Blizzard twenty million dollars. That's public knowledge. Twenty million dollars. The Overwatch League is not. It's like um, they they run it like a sports team. So it's not about who has the best group of friends. It's who has twenty million dollars and wants to hire players to play for their organization that they paid twenty million dollars for. Shut the fuck up. You guys don't believe me. How did you guys not know this? Yes. To register a team in the Overwatch League, you need to pay Blizzard $20 million. There's no way it costs that much. How much to play in Overwatch League? Yeah. Okay. First match. Overwatch League might be too expensive for traditional esports teams. It runs a cool 20 million on the low end. That's more than 10 times what a comparable franchise in League of Legends would cost. You you think you think they need ad revenue for their stream to pay for the arena? Right. It's the first match on Google, guys. This, this is public knowledge. I didn't make this shit up. $20 million is what you sign up an Overwatch team for. But they never talk to you or answer your emails. That's the base package. They just let, let you come. And they put you in the, in the rooms in the basement at the hotel. Because you only paid $20 million. It was the low-end package to be an Overwatch team. Ooh. Yeah, if you only paid twenty mil, only if you if you did the low end twenty million dollar Overwatch package, okay, when you need refreshments, it doesn't come with ice, okay, that's the premium package, all right, the, no ice, no ice. <laughs> Seriously, like what? How, how do you have to pay more? Like what do you? What else do you get if you pay more? Like, I don't understand. How is it the low end? Like, I didn't I didn't even know about that. No ice is better. <laughs> I don't know. This is actually kind of blowing my mind now. I, I, oh, oh, you can watch the Overwatch League on Twitch? Holy shit, that's crazy. The privilege. Yeah. Yeah, but if, if 20 million is the low end, what? How does it go behind? Like, what do you pay for? You're already paying for practically nothing. <laughs> if, I mean, are there people paying forty million? What do they get? Oh god! You have to pay twenty million to watch it on Twitch too. Well, if you want to watch it in Source, yeah. You get special skins that players can get for any character for your team. Oh, that's the premium package? Oh, jeez. It's only 5 million if you want to watch it on Twitch. Stop over-dramatizing. Shit, man. Has 40 million, you get a cool sticker. <laughs> oh, God. Where does it stop? Where does it stop? Oh my god. Going second again, baby rage! Oh my god, he top decked the dragon. Oh my god, that's shocking.
Oh my god, he got bookmarked. Oh my god, that's terrible. I think we played that so fucking well. But Deathwing plus good top decks is a bit difficult to deal with. Oh my god, he got bookworm. What? Yes. Why does that happen? Dude, this guy this guy must have played with too many fidget spinners to make that play. Blizzard must put in that feature just to get fucking highlights. Damn. Such a good fucking deck. Oh yeah, he's milking it. I think it's the sniper. The dude milled the card. He played pretty well. He played around everything I had ahead of time. He drew better spells for my deck than I did, and he milled a card just to keep the coin in hand. I had counterspell, obviously. He milled a fucking card to keep the coin. Come on, come on. I I, I guess that happens sometimes, but ah, uh, fuck. That was lame. Am I a salty person? Mostly when I play this. Holy shit, dude. What the fuck is that? What is this? This is called Crip Arena, guys. I couldn't deal with all the shit he was playing. Alright, guys. Give me a sec. I gotta go help Ranya up. Give me a minute. Alright, let me bring out the spreadsheet here. That marks 17 times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. I really think I'm like a science project for like Blizzard devs to screw with. I'm like the guinea pig where they test how much RNG is tolerable until you just like break your keyboard, right? Fuck you. That was a real bullshit arena, man. That was a cool deck. That was a really cool deck. But very, very unlucky. Arena's been good lately. I hate to stop playing arena on one of the most piece of shit arena runs I've had in like the last 10 days. Uh, I think I just gotta play with like a longer delay or something. Because that really felt like sniper running. All my opponents fucking chain emoting me, saving fucking coins and milling themselves for it against counterspell. Like, that was a whole lot of bullshit. Oh, come on! Dude, that's bull! Bullshit decks, bullshit RNG. I'm still drawing the situational cards. Like, of course. This is over. The? I just, I just beat Crip. That's like the worst drop ever fucking seen, dude. What the hell? 16 cards left, dude. There's like one situational card in there. Mark the lowest. That's it. Just one. Three and two, my fucking ass, I dude. A point where I had two situational cards and 19 cards in my deck, and I drew two of them in three turns. Like, I, I don't know. So he gained about 20 armor and played about 30 health worth of taunt. I lost against a deck that can't beat anything else. Like, that guy will, like, never beat a decent mage, a decent priest. Like, it... <laughs> that was just, like, Hunter Slayer Druid. Fuck. Priest. Fuck. Top deck on curve silence. Big thing attached. Top fucking deck, dude. I mean, I don't know how I win by going faith, but I know I absolutely have zero chance of winning if I trade. Because he has a bunch of cards. What the fuck is this? Alright, seriously. This guy had a perfect turn except for turn one. Every single turn is perfect. No mana wasted. 100% efficiency. Oh, I fucking hate priest. Playing priest. The tempo class, right? 
fucking priest. Fuck! No. Yeah, basically, I'm hoping that whoever I play against doesn't have perfect curve involving taunts, heals, and crushing win more mechanics. Because I'm playing Hunter, and I should do that. Especially with a deck with no late game. Going second, though, that's pretty bad. I think I would have won easily if he didn't top deck that turn 5 silence. That was so fucking crushing. This guy's a noob playing on a noob account at 0 2. But I'm going second as Hunter, so if he has a 1 drop, I actually lose most of the time. That might look like a 1 drop, but this guy's probably never seen a cards in his hand before, so. Hmm, okay. I can still beat people that have no idea how to play this game. Sweet. Oh, maybe not. Jesus. That's pretty ridiculous. Winter is here. Divine shield, taunt, life steal. What the fuck? That was the luckiest shit you could possibly have there. <sighs> Remember how we play arena and like most of the time we don't have a perfect curve leading into turn six? I just want my opponent to experience that a couple times. Hmm? Creep beat me because he's losing and I'm crying now. What? <laughs> yes, he beat me. Uh, yeah. Fuck! Dude, give me a fucking break here. Fuck you. Just like something. If my opponent's gonna get constantly ridiculously lucky, just give me a little bit of luck. Dude, it's every, every, I've been playing for an hour, right? Every, every single turn, I draw like shit, I get shit RNG, I mean, he has, he has a dragon, yeah, he has that too, right? I mean, I haven't had a one drop opener, I haven't even had a good two drop opener. I'm playing a deck with like, three cards that cost five mana, okay? Yeah, I'm fucking tilted right now. This is tilting as fuck. I keep seeing garbage players with garbage decks just get super lucky. Take it back. Not a garbage deck, but certainly a garbage player. Report him! Can we get can we get Ben Brode on the line? This guy played so fucking badly, it's blowing my mind. This is usually where he top decks lethal. This is the draw. Avenging Wrath. I guess it hit me. My opponent has perfect answer after perfect answer after perfect answer after really good RNG after perfect answer after perfect answer. Hearthstone's not a game you want to play when you're unlucky, man. Holy shit. Constant trash plays, trash trades. He did nothing right. Didn't matter. Went first, curved well. Good cards, get lucky. That's like 98% of this game. Really? Really, I try I try to Q dodge and it fucking crashes the game. Can we get Ben Brode on the line? Okay, no, it's back. Alright, here we go. I don't know what that was. Like, nearly crashed the game, I guess. It just froze. <laughs> what?! <laughs> nearly crashed the game. Oh, and I'm going second against the mage. Nice. Ugh. Uh, yes. Uh. Did the did the win not count? What? The win didn't count. Because this billion dollar company has a really well developed netcode. That's why that's why it didn't count. 
Uh, I cancelled the queue because I had a pretty good feeling I was getting sniped. Cancelling the queue froze the game. Then the game came back, actually dropped the queue. And I'm like, oh, okay. So then I try to queue back up. And when I queue back up, the game actually crashes. When I load back up, it puts me in the game that it dropped. I was in that game. I was in the game I disconnected from. I win that game. And the arena run is over. Can we buy some more packs? These 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 guys are clearly clearly not not doing this well enough. We we need to give them more packs, guys. We need Can you guys just buy like 100 packs right now, please? I think that's going to get this fixed along with all the rest, right? <laughs> It's not fine. Bark. What the fuck? That win counted. That win counted. I was three off. One. That counted as a win and it ended my arena run anyway. What the fuck? No, it counted as a win and it ended the arena. Well, my conspiracy theory is the more money you spend on Hearthstone, the more money they dump in Overwatch. <laughs> How do you think about my conspiracy theory? Yeah. The execs only have like 10 carat diamond encrusted sneakers. They gotta go to 12, okay? They gotta go to 12. Real developers wear 12 carat diamond sneakers. Alright. Seriously, I'm I'm blown away by how fucked up that was. The game crashed. I went back and played the game it crashed me from. I won. It counted as a win and it ended my arena run. I am blown away by that. Like, in my mind right now, you, you guys know in like the 40s, they had those like those workers that worked in like the telecommunication offices and they're taking like plugs from different outlets in the wall to connect people through the phone service. I feel like this is happening while everyone is playing Hearthstone. They're just like, oh, move this guy over here. That Was that a win? The, oh, oh shit, I plugged it in the wrong one. Like, I don't, how does this, how does everything that we see, like that makes no fucking sense happen in this game? This had no, that makes no fucking sense. All right, well, I guess that didn't do it, guys. We got to do another run. Hashtag thanks, Blizzard. Wrong hole. Wrong hole! <laughs> uh, what a joke. Seriously, what a joke. Am I really playing a game where my opponent fireball, fireball, pyroblasted me on curve in arena after winning the early game? Is that really the game I'm playing right now? Off of Cabalists. Well, that's it for Arena for the month, I guess. So fucking unlucky. Games with AI worse than hurts then. Donkey Kong? Original one, maybe? It's a hard one, man. It's a really hard one. We just have removal, so... Oh my god. Fuck! Dude! Give me a fucking break here! I'm dead. The craziest value mage you'll ever play in Arena just got a Death Knight off Cabal Courier, boys. The? I just, I just beat Crip. The bullshit luck continues today. Honestly, if this run tanks, I'm done for the night for Arena. I'm not playing this shit. I can't have two really good decks tank just because of bad matchups and bad luck constantly. Most likely has the wandering spirit. Fuck you. 
basically the five mana spawn four three threes is uh, a little bit much to deal with tempo wise. Fuck, that was insane. That guy's deck was really good. Yeah, I think when a hunter goes first and spawns four three threes, it's very difficult to win as anything. It's part of the hunter high roll package. So if he doesn't also has a, have a flame strike, like, do you know how fucking mental that would be? Like, his opening hand would be Pyros, exploding runes, exploding. What the fuck? Surprise, motherfucker! Yeah, Pyros, exploding runes, exploding runes, corridor creeper, blizzard flame strike. That's unreal. What the fuck? <laughs> How is this one and one? How is it possible? How do you lose a game with this? How the fuck can you get so lucky while being such an asshole? Oh, great. That's like three out of my four hammers have given taunt so far. I don't have a fight. I just lose. I lose. There you go. Game over. I can't win. I can't play anything into that. I can't play two things. I'm gonna be out of cards. He has Pyros. His deck is better than I've ever had it, and uh, yeah, that's it. That's the game. Can I stop getting fucked on RNG? I don't know. Am I getting sniped or some shit? Like this is, this is like 12-0 opener. This is not what you can't lose with the deck like that. You just can't. Oh, it's curving out into big minions now. Okay, sure. You think he has yet another perfect removal here? Maybe it's a bone mare. Oh no. Yeah, people with crazy decks, crazy hands, and everything going for them, they typically get lucky with babbling book or something. Yeah, here we go. So Firelands portal time. Mind control. Seventeen times I've beat Crip. Oh, better luck next time. Honestly, if I experience a game like that in the next two, I'm, I'm so done for Arena you know, Fruit tonight, and fuck playing this game without a delay. There's no chance these games are normal. There's no chance I'm playing these guys just, just by chance so frequently. Like, Arena's actually very consistent right now. To be at one and one with a deck like that, and it's like, I don't know, I've experienced that so much the other day. There's just no way this is normal. There's no way. I'm playing Arena for like three weeks now under these new rules. Decks like that do not lose. Okay, so like I'm putting that game in my best decks highlights. I have three games in the best decks highlights so far. So that's the top three decks I've ever played against at one and one when Arena is at its peak for consistency. I'm sure that's fucking chance. And here we go, Hunter. Absolute dice roll, mostly needs to go first. And here we are, going second against him. Uh, fuck. I'm so fucking tilted right now. Oh look, a one drop going first as a Hunter. All right. Oh, that's... Yeah, dude, that one and two. That totally happens all... Okay. Does guy live under a rock? Like, what? It's like one of those broken early game combos in the game. Let alone arena. Let alone at one and two. It's like literally free win. Renounce into Hunter. Off the top. What is this? This is called Crip Arena, guys. Not something you want to experience. Okay, let's play wild. Bullshit decks. Just constantly never lucky bullshit losing to absolute trash tier players. Bullshit RNG. I'm so sick of it, man. It's been like a couple of days of this. I don't.
don't think it's zero three material, but it is. It is pretty damn bad. I don't think it's zero three material. Arbus, perfect. Well done. Shit, I'm dead. No, no. I got crazy fucking unlucky that game, dude. Yeah, literally the Holy Wrath outcome was the game. Like, everything I did got punished. If I got one, I lose. If I got anything else, I probably win. Getting wrecked again. Can't do fucking anything. Yeah, I've just been so fucking unlucky. Like, give me a break. Yeah, I'm dead, 100%. No, I thought I was alive. Only have one two drop left in the deck. Can you guys just buy like a hundred packs right now, please? I think that's gonna get this fixed, along with all the rest, right? No, this is bullshit. Like, great decks, great answers, crap RNG, crap hands for me. There's really nothing to it. Oh, come on. This is fucked up, dude. I already don't have three two drops in my deck. I have two two drops. That's bullshit. That was just tragic fucking luck. I already don't want to play Harrison today. Like, fuck me. That guy's deck was really good. Why would I be salty? I'm at zero. Like, what the fuck is that? Coin eviscerate at zero two into SI7. At zero fucking two. Should have played around it. Am I right? <laughs> Two god tier level cards on the same turn, only possible with the coin after already playing a good 2 drop and a good 3 drop at 0 2. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's wonderful. That's why we play Arena. So we can play people who can get the 12 wins at 0 2. That's why we play Arena, guys. I know I have a bad deck, but this is ridiculous. At 0-2, you should never play anyone like this. Absolutely never. Yeah, this is definitely my last arena run. I'm not even sure I want to play Hearthstone the rest of the night. Sorry, guys, but this is this is just ass. I have no. I can't do anything. This is just no decision making. There's no. There's no play. There's no decision. There's nothing I can do to win. I can only win if my opponent doesn't have a crazy as fuck deck at 0-2 and gets lucky while I get unlucky. That's if that happens, I just can't win. Oh look. Combos. Wonderful. Oh look, another really good card at 0-2. Maybe I'll draw Consecration for the first time in my life. No, nah, probably not. No, I just I, I don't know. Maybe I'm getting sniped. I don't know what the fuck's going on. I should not have played that guy at 0-1. I should not have played this guy at 0-2. This guy's playing well with a ridiculous rogue deck. Like, the best class in Arena. It's hard to get a good deck. He has a ridiculous deck at 0-2. I don't buy it. I honestly don't buy it. He hasn't played a single card below, like, 65 points. This is just bullshit. And I'm getting unlucky. I drew runner, runner, two drop to invalidate a turn four call to arms. I only have four two drops. And I've never seen Consecration. Never seen it. I can still win? Really? You think so? He's busting on all my divine shields because he knows I have this. Right? <laughs> I dino sized and I'm still dead on the board. Yeah, with Call to Arms in hand, drawing a 2-drop on turn 2 and 3 that aren't good to play on turn 2 and 3. Dude, what the fuck? Oh, look. Consecration! Woo. Yeah, with my luck, I just gave him Blessing of Kings for lethal. No, I'm literally going to 0-3. There's no fucking chance I win this game. Like, the only chance I win this game is by a balanced RNG, which would be the equivalent of, like, a lightning strike just just completely blowing up his router right now. Like, this instant. That's my only chance. 
Like, how do I win? Even if I draw equality, it's not enough. How, how do I stay alive? No, no chance. Fuck it. I'm done. That's it. <sighs> I don't know. Yeah, I'm like a little buzzed, but it doesn't matter. I don't know if I'm getting sniped. I don't know if that was just the unluckiest shit ever. Doesn't matter. That was like super fucking never lucky. That guy could easily get 12 wins. Easily. He had zero bad cards. He had ridiculous cards overall as a rogue deck at 0 and 2. Absolute bullshit. Absolute bullshit. I go 12 wins with crap rogue decks all the time. Ridiculous rogue decks have no problems winning. Ridiculous rogue decks don't go 0 2 unless you're like intentionally losing games. Yeah, I'm done with Arena. That's it. I'm done. Actually, I don't even feel like playing Hearthstone after that. I'm not playing Hearthstone. I'm done. Sorry, guys. I know some of you guys want me to play Hearthstone and stuff, but. I don't feel like playing. After that, I don't feel like playing. I'm gonna play some Hero Academy too. It's a sponsored game I played like two days ago. I'm playing again today. It's not sponsored. I'm playing because I like the game. <laughs> I like Hearthstone too. Just not on some days. Today is that day. You guys know I think Arena's good right now, but that was bullshit. I honestly think I'm getting major sniped. I don't have a delay today. Maybe that was a grave mistake. I don't know. That was just a horrible experience. I played against three decks. I can go 12 wins. I got really unlucky in every single game. My opponents got lucky in every single game. I don't want to experience that again. That's it. Sorry. If you want to experience that, you go play Hearthstone for yourself.